How's it going everyone? My name is Mr. Reptile23 here and welcome to a game called Monster DNA where instead of, you know, normally running away from monsters, we're actually making monsters. Man, this game looks pretty freaking terrifying and uh, I'm excited to give it a try though. So make sure if you do enjoy the video, just scroll down a little bit and leave a like there for me. And of course, if you are new to the channel and you happen to like what you see, you should consider subscribing. All of this is about your boy, and I really do appreciate all the love and support. So, let's not wait any longer, man. Let's get straight into Monster DNA. What do we got here first? Sign in. Enter down below your name. Maximum amount of letters is six. Using already an existing name will lead to consequences. How about... Brian. Looks like I can go in. Who's this dude here? What are you? You got really skinny legs, man. I'm assuming I have to talk to you. <laughs> Hi. Hi. Hi, you fucking. Well, hello there. Hi. How are you? Your new role will be a DNA hybrid specialist. Before you go, let me make a few things clear. Okay. No, no, like, like the rat. Um, I know you humans are always a mess, so I left you instructions on how to run the machine. Thank you. Review the monsters and the missions before you merge them. Okay. Remember, don't get yourself killed by the monsters you produce. <laughs> I hope I don't die either, man. Now go on, go. Okay, I'll go, but don't ever grab me like that again. Ugh, that was terrible. Okay. Okay, anywho. Today's mission. Looks like these are the four monsters that we are supposed to make. Information about our tablet here. You can preview each base monster. View, then choose to create a hybrid of the two base monsters. For further information, please read their con co corresponding story. Gosh, sometimes it's hard to read. Okay. So it looks like we need to make an old-fashioned coastal monster, leaves good impressions, wiser in the ways of life, no teeth, but chews enemies without blinking, and slow in movement but lots of artificial parts. Holy cow. That seems like a, a lot. Goggles. Uh, back up. God, how do I get these goggles off my face? Okay. Alright, um... Okay. Oh, nope, we're not doing that. Okay. So, we're gonna keep that up. What's this? Ah, cool, something I can read. Monster DNA, read the seven original stories to find out what you have to merge to get the mission completed. Click the left button to locate it in the middle of the desk. Click the DNA slot on the right to choose the right monster color code. Click the red button to merge. Take the tablet from the hybrid monster. Open the quality control tab on the main tablet. Check what the quality control tablet is seeking. Answer the quality control test according by the using the tablet given by the monster. When you are done, send the monster away. Repeat until your shift is over. Note, the lever can be used, the glass can be pulled down and up. The glasses should be used to check whether the monster has aura or not. Keep using them at each creation to see. And if something is blinking blue, it means it's in the process or cannot be used at the moment. All right. Let's see what we got here. Looks like we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight monsters. All right. Then we have to read their story. So let's start with Steven. What's Steven look like? Oh, he's, he's got a little cleaver in his uh, head there. Steven lived all of his life in Butchland, where all the butchers thrived. He loved his cuts of meat so much that he slowly but surely he developed a taste for butchering butchers. He opened a shop with the meat he illegally acquired and kept his secret for years. One day a customer noticed a skin pattern of someone close to him in one of the cuts he bought. Stephen was sentenced to life. Jesus criminy. Big nose, big ears. Light blue. At a very young age, Dolphy was in one of the most feared gangs on the planet called Oceanac. He and his gang believed that smaller fish weren't aware as he was, thus not as worthy. This belief drove them to exploit the weaker inhabitants of the ocean. He found his downfall when he, when he led the attack for their next heist. The smaller fish united and managed to capture Dolphy as his gang fled the scene. Can live underwater, intelligent, sharp teeth. Damn, Dolphy. 
Moifi. I, I hope that's right. Uh, Moifi came from a long line of. Oh my God! Look at him. Uh, came from a long line of nuclear survivors. His grandfather witnessed the end of the third planetary war. His family prided themselves on their mutations, as they should. But sadly, they went too far when they intentionally spread their mutations, thinking everyone should be like them. Long neck, sharp teeth, bony nose. Scally. Scally was an iconic movie star back in 5,498. Damn! From the planet Celtra. What? Celestria. Dude, this dude looks like Red Skull from Captain America, man. Leaving a huge legacy in the industry. One day, his original agency decided they needed the star to come back from his grave for a perfect role they had found for him. He woke up confused, but being the professional he was, he jumped right into filming. Unfortunately, his anger and violent temper were no longer tolerated. He ended up killing multiple crew members for extremely trivial reasons. The trials were nasty because everything Scally did was illegal back in his time. So he got one of the longest sentences, 463 years. Bones, meat, hollow eyes. Damn. Red Skull. Alien Grandpa in 1999 before the Third Planetary War. Alien, as he had been called in Planet Earth, had a mission to observe and understand human behavior, hoping to gain insight into how different species interact. Alien spent 356 years on Earth and, has, and his research went nowhere, and he did not reach any conclusion. As a result, his home planet refused to take him back. Alien Grandpa, as he was referred to at the time, snapped, completed, as his fellow Earthen said, leading him to deported for intergalactic terroristism. Damn. Sam, a known scientist from Astralis, the land of modification, altered himself too many times, escaping from planet to planet to evade his crimes. His constant shape of shifting made him one of the most wanted fugitives in the New World. Sam eventually forgot what his original, most infamous form looked like. Having been shape-shifting for decades when he tried to change back to do it, he was immediately identified, leading to his downfall. Big lips, horns, sharp cheekbones. What about Dick? Before Dick became the criminal he is today, he wanted to be a comedian. He hustled doing stand-up comedy from galaxy to galaxy, always hunting the next big gig. At the time, his gig's dates always lined up with an infamous serial killer called the Smile Butcher, the police picked up on that and found a big link. Every victim went to Dick's show and booed him. Big smile, square head, small eyes. He's just a little guy. Look at him. That's scary. I don't want to do that again. <laughs> and our last one is Adam. Sometimes nature will devour and nurture. Adam came from a loving home, but sadly the sick monster committed unspeakable crimes against whoever crossed his path in Earth. He looks like a human. Although creatures from where Adam comes from do not transfer physical features because they have very basic DNA. They can transfer their psyche. Rotten inner self, violent tendencies, suppressed desires. All right, so now we're gonna start actually making the monsters. So the first one being old fashioned and coastal monster. I'm gonna say Dolphy is that coastal part. Which, wait, what color is he? Dolphy is green. So we're gonna try to grab green first. Long line of nuclear survivors. Father witnessed the third planetary war. Somebody saw the second one before the third. Yeah, okay, so. We'll do Alien Grandpa, which light pink, which is this one. Let's see if that uh, does the mission right. We did it! Oh! I don't like that. Can I have that? Ugh, I don't want to. Give me that. I'm about to put that back up. Woo! All right. Monster quality control. Is the is the monster's? Hey 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 hey! Don't do that. Is the monster's tongue split? No. Does he have fangs? I would say so. Does the monster spin when attack? Stop it! I don't know. You would turn violent. Why he's spinning so much. Alright, fair enough. I would say no. 
Doesn't have horns. No. I mean, not really. Stop it. Or, don't have ears. So, submit. That's one monster done. I don't really know what this part is for. It's for the testing part. Duh, idiot. Anywho. Okay, let's see what we got here. Leaves good impressions. Wiser in the ways of life. Which means we need the old person again, which is alien grandpa. Light pink. Light pink. Leaves good impressions. Wiser in the ways of life. Who leaves good press? A big smile does. Dark blue. Let's try that. Dark blue and pink. Monster making time! Let's see if I got it. I don't know if that... I did it! Yeah! Let's go! Uh, you don't look very smiley. <laughs> you don't look... Uh... You don't look very... What's up with all y'all trying to pull the damn bar down? Stop that shit. Uh, no, your tongue's not split. Do you spin when you attack? Okay. No spinning while attacking. Check. Um, you don't have horns. You don't have a human base. How do you react to some gas? You seem to react to the gas. I saw that. You tried to juke me. And now I'm going to spin you. So he, I think he does react to the gas. And nothing else, really. You like spinning? Dimension Planet. Damn. Goodbye! Alright, so we got two out of the four. Let's go. Let's see what else we got. No teeth, but choose enemies without blinking. Who doesn't have teeth? Destroyed eye, missing teeth. A Alien Grandpa seems to be the guy here, so we're gonna go with light pink since he has no teeth. Whoops, I gotta pull up thing. Light pink. And but choose enemies without the linking. Is that the? Is that this guy right here? The one with the big ass teeth? Yeah, it is. Um, but he doesn't seem like. He would chew people up quickly. Hmm. This guy's got violent tendencies. I think I'm gonna go with Adam. I think Adam's orange, but I'm just gonna double check because I'm a silly goose. And didn't look. Adam is orange. So we're gonna do Adam and angry grandpa. See if we get that combination. Hopefully, I'm right. Can we hit three for three? Yeah, three for three. You look very menacing, sir. You look like a cactus. Hey, you know the scoffers. You know the drill. Okay, well, you, you don't. You look very menacing. I will say that at the least. Um, spin time. No tongue split. You don't have fangs. You don't spin. You don't have horns. Well, you count that as horns. You don't say you have horns. Adam, yeah, that counts. Do you react to gas? You look so mad. Oh, you do. Don't. Get him out of here before he freaking breaks through that glass. All right, so we're three for three, man. That's awesome. Now we just need to do four. Slow in movement, but lots of artificial parts. That last part's gonna confuse me, I think. Slow in movement. Who's slow, bro? Don't tell, don't tell me Anchor Gra our alien grandpa is gonna be the boy for all this. We'll keep that in mind. Who's slow? Or too many. Sam? It's It should be Sam. Oh. I think it's gonna be Sam and Alien Grandpa. Alien Grandpa is light pink. It's gotta be him and modification. Yeah. Forgot what the original. Hmm. 
We're gonna go with Sam, I think. Yeah. Unless... We'll see if that technically it counts for slow in movement, but lots of artificial parts. Let's see if it works. Come on, baby. Like that bad boy is green. Yeah. Oh, my God. I can't believe we just... Uh, what are you? I'm so glad. Oh, dude, we just did that first try. Holy cow, we're nuts. All right. Stop it. Are you violent? Do you spin when you attack? No. All right. You don't have horns. You're not human base. You like gas? You react to that? Yeah, you do. You react to that. You don't have ears either. Spin move. That's it. Right? We got all four objectives done. Your shift is over. Oh, get away from me. Dear Brian, your shift is over. Let's see how you need to determine your future in our monster DNA labs. Okay. Testing in HD. Damn. Quality control. Wow. Hybrids created nice. You have. You look good. I wasn't even done reading that. Uh, let's go. We did it. We're so awesome. First try, man. We were creating a bunch of damn monsters, and we didn't even we didn't get smoked once. Thank God for the bars, dude. That was awesome. I love the concept of this game. It's supposed to be different every time you play it too. So I mean, why not go check it out in the description for yourselves and try it for yourselves? Because this game's pretty awesome. Besides that one little jump scare in the beginning, that was not cool. But you know, we we move. But make sure if you guys did enjoy the video, you just scroll down a little bit and leave a like for me. And of course, if you are new to the channel and you happen to like what you see, you should consider subscribing. All it does is help out my channel in the end, and I really do appreciate all that love and support. But until next time, thank you all so much for watching. I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.